First of all, I want to start by saying 2019 has been the most transformational year of my life. I'll tell you why. One word, ayahuasca. What is ayahuasca, I hear you asking? Well, it's basically a plant medicine. It's an ancient shamanic brew. It's been around for over 5,000 years. And it's only just recently hit kind of like the Western world, Western culture. Terence McKenna is a big advocate. Graham Hancock is another advocate. Joe Rogan, all these kind of modern day um, psychonauts and celebrities are catching on to it. And now I know why, because it's changed my life. And it's really inspired me to want to make this video and tell you all about my journey. I've had eight different ceremonies this year. I've drank around 20 cups of ayahuasca. Um, it's taken me to another dimension. It's um, made me see so much and made me understand and appreciate everything about life. Uh, I've got nothing but gratitude for, for my life, for the universe, for humanity, and it's all thanks to what the plants have taught me. I used to live in my head, you know. I used to suffer from anxiety. I have depression. I used to gamble. I would do drugs. I would womanize and all because I lived in my head, and it all comes from childhood trauma. So when we're young, we are connected to our souls. And what happens is when you experience any kind of trauma, whether it's neglect, sexual abuse, physical abuse, or whether you're even just witnessing abuse, whether you're watching an animal be killed, or whether you see your father hit your mother, whatever it might be, it causes a soul split to happen in you. So your soul becomes distant from yourself. And then as you grow older, this manifests in many different ways. For me, it was like alcohol uh, manifesting unhealthy relationships, um, not looking after money, not looking after my body. And over the years, you know, I felt very lost the way many people do in society today. People are depressed, suicide rates are sky high, people are turning to food, um, people are turning to drugs and alcohol as a way to fill a void. And all that void is the void left by the soul split. So what plant medicine done for me was it made me become face to face with who I was. It showed me who I've become. Um, it then helped me to merge back with my soul and eventually it healed my heart. That's what happened during the first four ceremonies. Then more recently, it showed me my purpose. And ayahuasca told me directly that my purpose was to help change the world. And it just so happens that I own a page called Educate, Inspire, Change. The motto being, educate yourself, inspire others, change the world. And it's given me the inspiration to make this video, to make more videos, to really communicate with all my followers and everyone out there who's listening to this video about the power of the medicine and about the power of self-love. I now love myself so much where I live from here. I no longer live from here. So ayahuasca took me on a journey from my head to my heart. And so when I'm speaking to you just now, this is completely unrehearsed, no script. I'm just talking to you from the heart because I love myself so much, I feel like I have something to give you and I want to give it to you by leading you towards plant medicine or any other form of um, mindfulness that might help you. Plant medicine isn't the only way. There's meditation, there's yoga, there's nutrition, there's just self-love, um, positive thinking, positive words, affirmations. There's so many ways, but ayahuasca, it's, it can be comparable to, in the, in the uh, medical world, surgery. So sometimes if you have a, a, a disease, you can't heal it through nutrition or through meditation. You could have to go to a brain surgeon to remove a tumour, for example. Ayahuasca is very much like this. During ceremonies, I experienced different types of cosmic surgery where other beings, call them aliens, call them light beings, whatever you like. I felt like they were on my body, in my mouth, in my heart, in my head, and they were repairing all the years of trauma that I've suffered, not even myself, but also from the trauma that my ancestors have suffered. So it goes right, right back to the beginning from when your soul was born, not your body, your soul. So for me, I feel like I've had a healed heart. Um, I think carefully before I speak, I react much more better to confrontation. Um, I'm much more focused, much more driven. I'm eating healthier. I'm enjoying time with my loved ones more. I'm appreciating nature more. I'm just loving life more. And I've got plant medicine to thank. And if you're thinking about where to start, I went to a place in Costa Rica called Rhythmia, ran by a good friend of mine called Jerry, Jerry Powell. Rhythmia is a fantastic place. It's the first medically licensed plant medicine retreat. 
you've got comfort there, you've got security there, it's like a five-star resort, you've got doctors on hand, psychologists on hand. If you're thinking of doing ayahuasca for the first time and you can afford to go to Costa Rica, I highly recommend Rhythmia as the place for you to go. Well, 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 well